guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Jen. I hope that you'll consider subscribing to my channel because I have so much fun holiday content coming your way and I'm just really excited about the holidays. So I want to share so much right now. I literally just decorated my office space here. You can see my Mickey tree and I have my lights up over by my bookcase and I'm just so excited to start sharing some fun holiday videos with you guys and I am going to start with my holiday gift guide for 2020. I have a variety of different items. Most of them are not very expensive at all. I would say I typically don't spend more than $50 on a gift. So I would say most of these items range anywhere from maybe $20 to $50, but obviously there will be a couple that are a bit more than that, but not very much more. These items are not going to be ridiculously expensive, and I think that they will fit in most people's budget. And I have items for both men and women and household items that are great as couple gifts or family gifts and things like that. So I'm gonna get right into this because I have quite a bit to share with you. I am going to start with an electric blanket. Now, I know some people say that this can be dangerous. It might not be the best thing to have it on the highest setting all night long, every single night, but we live in a very old drafty house and I have one on my bed. They come in a variety of different sizes. This is by Sunbeam. I'll leave links below for all of the items that I can find, but I turn this on before I get into bed and it warms up my bed so nicely. And when I climb in, it's just so warm and cozy. And then I turn it off and it's just wonderful. <laughs> I know so many people are sharing different types of blankets this year from the weighted blankets to the fleece blankets to the beautiful Ugg blankets that are out there. But I'm telling you this old school electric blanket has been such an amazing item to have in my house lately and I think it makes for a great gift for anyone really and everyone in my family has one currently because like I said the old drafty home so this is wonderful and I think it's a great great gift fun and maybe different kind of gift to share with somebody is this bubble bath okay so Avon this year has this very vintage Parisian themed gift guide in their I guess this is one of their most recent catalogs and I'll just show you the cover of this and how beautiful it is but I had to get this cat the second I saw it I was like this would make such a nice gift for a friend your mom your aunt your sister like anyone it's just so adorable and I still have it in the plastic wrap because obviously I am going to be gifting most of the items that I'm sharing with you today but I think it's beautiful and it's about $35 I believe it's this really big decanter it's filled with bubble bath and it is just adorable look at the detail in the face if you have a cat lover or just somebody who's into paris or who is just into vintage looking containers and decor and things to keep around their house i just think this is gorgeous and i'm going to show you one more item that they had because they also had these beautiful lipsticks that are also vintage inspired and they're packaged so nicely and i'm going to be honest i chose this lipstick based on the container that it's in but it's also very neutral and it's this beautiful pink container just look at the really really pretty design on that and this color is it's the la la lipstick and the color is frills and i'll just show you the color of this and like i said i think it's a very subtle color that most people could probably wear and it's beautiful i just love it so really really nice i'm sure most of you have a local person who sells avon in your area i can share my friend who sells avon in the description below as well but i just love this i think it's so pretty and they had a lot of other vintage inspired items this year so avon did a really really nice job this year Something else that I think is a really wonderful gift is this book. It's called Simple Abundance. I have the original one that was written back in the 90s, so it is rather dated, but they updated it, I think, this year for 2020. And this is a day book, and I just, I can't even tell you how much this has changed my life. 
I've had this book probably for maybe 10 years and I still find myself refer referencing it most days. So it has every day of the year and it has all of these just like very inspiring quotes, things from other books, things from different poets. And then it's just very inspirational. So she is really a seasonal writer. The things that she talks about is very relevant to what is going on seasonally. And she will talk about spring cleaning or preparing for the holidays or things like how depressed people can tend to get in the winter months and she addresses everything on a daily basis and I just feel like when I'm feeling anxious or I have a lot of things that I'm dealing with at the time, a lot going on, whatever's going on in my life, it's like she knows it because I'll just open up to that day and I'll read the entry and it will always calm me. It will always be something very relatable, something that I'm dealing with at that time in my life and it's just, it's perfect. And I just think this is a really feel good read for anyone. I purchased this for a friend of mine and I'm really anxious to share it with her and I hope that she enjoys it as much as I have over the years. This book is also on my wish list this year because I would really love to have this updated version of it. I know times are rough in 2020 and we are not traveling the way that we used to, but I'm a travel agent and I always have travel on my mind and I really love to travel. And one thing that I really appreciate and enjoy is a really good beach bag and this bag is unbelievable. So it's so big. <laughs> First of all, that's one of the nice things. It is enormous. You can fit so many things in this bag. This is by a company called Shilero. And it has really cool features, which is why I love it. The rope handle, I adore. And then there is this little buckle here for your keys, like a little key fob. It is completely lined inside. And like I said, this fits a ton of stuff. You could actually also use this as a really nice travel bag. On this side, <laughs> there's so many cool gadgets. This side, there's a bottle holder. And then on the inside, oh gosh, there's so many compartments. So you, so you have this compartment here, it's just a little slip compartment. And then on the other side, you have this nice big zipper compartment and then check this out this is so cool it comes with this is like a fanny pack and it's clear <laughs> so it can protect your iphone or any electronics that you have a camera and it's also a fanny pack so if you're at the beach and i know this has happened to all of us and you're gonna take a walk on the beach and the only thing you have with you is maybe your cell phone and a credit card and you don't wanna leave it at the blanket, clear fanny pack, you can strap it on and go for your walk and have no worries and you don't have to like hold it the whole time when you're walking along the shoreline by the ocean. And I just, I love this bag, it's just really awesome. I actually have a coupon code for this as well so I'll leave it below. I believe it's for like 15% off, which is pretty good. And plus it's not even that expensive anyway, especially considering how much money I've spent on 31 bags and bags like that in the past. This is, it's really nice. That's all I could say. So, oh, and there's pockets on the sides too. So on either side, there's another slip pocket, which I always like to use these compartments to put the sunscreen for the kids so they're not digging through all my things. So I love to have outer pockets for them to access things. So. We will be traveling to Disney this summer. We will be going down the shore this summer. I am always in high hopes of doing all of the things, even though COVID's still going on. I feel like we are reaching, hopefully reaching the end and at the very least able to still enjoy some time at the beach. So great idea. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna move on. I said enough about that bag. <laughs> Something that most men I know can use nearly every year or two is a new wallet. And I found this company called Andar, and they sell not only wallets, but other types of travel bags and computer covers and all kinds of beautiful, beautiful leather accessories, key fobs, I'm looking at their little thing now. They have AirPod cases and things like that. So it comes packaged in this really nice box. And again, this is something that I'm going to be gifting to someone this year. So it comes out of here. And this one is called the Ranger and it was $55. 
It has a little slip pocket here so that you can put your most used credit card here or your ID so you can easily pull it out. And then it has a couple of slots on top. And then this is cool. So it's kind of like a money clip. You don't have a slit here to put the money. And this is only one of many different varieties. So if you prefer the other kind, they obviously have that as well. But this is almost like a money clip. So you can just fold up your money and slip it in here. And then it also has this nifty little pull string. So you pull it and it will like pop out your <laughs> credit cards. You know, when they get stuck in there, I always have an issue with that. So this is such a beautiful gift for someone and I really think it's going to make a nice gift for somebody in my life as well. All right, my next item, they have this for men and for women, but the one that I purchased is for women and it, this is the Sephora Favorites Perfume Sampler. All right, this is what is so cool about this and they have a cologne collection as well. You get all of these perfumes, you get a sample size of them, so I'll show you. <laughs> Sorry for the sound effects. So here it just, it gives you the description of how you're going to do this. So you're going to try the fragrance and you're going to give yourself some time to enjoy it, to see which one you like the best. And then when you decide which one you like the best, you go ahead and you order the full size perfume. So this is what it looks like. And you can see it's basically all just like the sample sizes. And there's enough in there that you can try it for probably a day or two. And then there is a card where you can pick your favorite one and you can get the full size. So I just think this is such a great idea because oftentimes I want to purchase perfume for people, and I'm apprehensive because it's just such a personal thing and you really don't know what people are going to like or not like. And this way you can give them a whole collection to try. They can pick their favorite and they can send away for the full size. So I just think it's a wonderful idea. And I know this is on my daughter's Christmas list. So <laughs> it's definitely a fun thing to have. As we're approaching the new year, I absolutely think an amazing Christmas gift is a new planner for the upcoming year. And Plum Paper Planner has some really nice options. In the past, I have always used the Erin Condren Planner and I'll have promo codes to both below. Actually, I'll have a promo code below for Erin Condren, but Plum Paper, if you would like to take advantage of the coupon that I can offer you, just email me and let me know. and. I can email you the promo code through Plum Paper, but if they have your email address, I won't be able to do it. So I, when I talked about this planner previously, I'll leave a link above if you want like more of a walkthrough of it. But when I did talk about that, a lot of people still went on the site and they offered up their email address. And once you do that, I cannot give you the coupon. So please make sure before you do anything, just email me and I'll forward you the coupon so you can get a nice discount on the planner. Anyway, that being said, these planners are so beautiful and what I love about Plum Paper is you can make it, you can like make the layout exactly as you want it. So for me, I'll just show you an example of what I mean. On the top I have YouTube so I can put my YouTube content up there and then I also coordinated the days by morning, afternoon, and evening because that's just kind of how I lay out my days. And then I have a section on the other side of the page for Mickey World Travel Work, which that's the travel agency I work for. So if I have trips coming up that week or clients that I need to follow up with, I can write that in that block there as a reminder. And then over here, I have my exercise routine. And this is everything that I personally chose for the layout. So they also have a standard. So if you're buying it for a gift and you don't know the person all that well to personalize it for them, you can just also buy the standard planner, but there's fun stickers that they have as well. And there's fun options. And I just really think a planner is a great gift idea for the upcoming new year. And while I'm talking about items to purchase for the upcoming new year, something that I tried for the first time this year and I love, and I am actually asking for as well for 2021, one is the Ali Edwards One Little Word workshop and also the book that coincides with it. You can purchase the workshop for somebody and you can also purchase them the starter kit or they can do it on their own. It's not necessary to use her products. You can literally get 
one of your own binders and you can fill it up and just like follow her game plan but use your own items or you can use some of the kits that she sells as well so it's up to you but i'll leave her link below for her website if you want to check it out this is not sponsored so just so that you know i don't think i have any nothing here is sponsored nobody's paying me <laughs> to talk about any of this stuff so these are just things that i've used and love but i probably have shown this several times in the past and again I'll leave a link above if you want to see more about this book specifically but you choose your word of the year and she has all of these monthly prompts that you follow and you fill out the book so my word of the year was connect and she does sell these words that you can glue onto the front of your album and I just had so much fun doing this, especially this year. I never knew that this year was going to be what it was. It was kind of a crazy year. We all know that, right? If this is not something that you're into, she also has this Day in the Life album, which I only did it one day. I did it on March 9th. And I was clueless to COVID on this day. I just, I had no idea. And it was so ironic that I chose this day because I think it was March 13th that everything in my area shut down and all of this came to a head. So here we are, March 9th was my day in the life that I chose. And anyway, it's just, it's a fun project. And if you have somebody in your life that is crafty and likes memory keeping, I really think they would enjoy one of these workshops that she offers. Another item that makes for a really great gift is a personalized cutting board. We were, it's upside down. <laughs> Me and my husband received this as a gift from my mom a few years ago and look at how beautiful this is. It has held up so well and I have seen these on Amazon, not that expensive and you can personalize them any way that you would like. So jb is both my initials and my husband's initials so that works out pretty well but you can put the last name or some type of a saying or a note or a date however you would like to do it and this one in particular is so nicely made i will find either the same one or something very similar to it and share it with you guys in the description below but i think this is a really great gift and a lot of men enjoy cooking and i know my husband does enjoy doing it when he has the time to and we both really really love this cutting board i just think it's so pretty and it definitely makes for a nice couple's gift especially if you have a newly married couple that maybe doesn't have anything like this in their home yet really really nice right, i have a couple more items <laughs> i know this is a lot i have no idea how long this video is going to be but there's so much that i want to share with you guys this really isn't even everything there's so much more i could possibly share but i wanted to kind of share with you guys my absolute favorites things that i have been gifted in the past and things that i am also gifting to other people and I just, I think they're really great ideas. The next one is the Echo Dot. And we actually purchased this for a whole bunch of people last Christmas and everyone loved it. I think Amazon had an amazing deal one day and we just bought one for pretty much everyone. <laughs> and we were done with our Christmas shopping. And we have these in probably every bedroom in the house as well as the kitchen. It can play music for you. It can answer questions for you. Alexa helps my children with their homework every single day. <laughs> so it's just really been such an amazing thing. She also helps me with my spelling and my math because I'm not great either with those things. And I just, I can't tell you enough how much I love this, especially now this time of year, because I'm listening to Christmas music all of the time. So whatever room I'm in, I can listen to Christmas music and that's just great. So I really appreciated it today when I was decorating my tree back here and I had all of my Christmas music playing and it's just a handy nifty little thing. Something else that I think is a fun idea for a book lover, you know I have to say something about books in this video because I love reading and I've been doing a lot of it, especially this year. So I think a really great gift for somebody who loves books is a subscription to Book of the Month Club. Again, I am not sponsored, but I am obsessed with Book of the Month Club because number one, all of the books that I have gotten from them this past year have been like some of my favorite books that I have ever read. This was my favorite 
October book, my favorite spooky book this year. This book was amazing. And all of the books that I have read thus far from Book of the Month Club have been really, really good. You can see, I don't know if you can see it back there. I have one day in December. That's going to be a holiday read that I'm doing with my patrons. So I just think it's so much fun and it's really not that expensive. If you use my promo code, again, I have so many promo codes for things you get a really great discount on your first subscription and then you can skip months, but it's $15 a month and you don't have to get it every month. And your first month will be ridiculously cheap if you use the promo code. So I just think it makes a nice gift and I absolutely love gifts that you get every month of the year. It's just so much fun to receive that package every month and to get that email from them when the new books of the month come out and you can pick them out you can pick out the one that you want and it's just it's so exciting and so much fun so i just think a subscription box in general is a really really nice idea and i most especially love subscription boxes that are inexpensive so for 15 dollars a month to me that's more affordable than a lot of the other subscription boxes that are out there and again if you know somebody who loves to read you cannot go wrong with book of the month club okay guys that is going to be it for today i am sure there will be more to come your way but this is just some of my favorite gift giving ideas and i thought i would share it with you i hope that you enjoyed this video and hearing some of the things that i am going to be gifting to friends and family this year if you have not yet subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to my channel i would greatly appreciate it don't forget to leave a comment below. I would love to hear some of your favorite go-to Christmas gifts because I know we all have them. We all have those certain items that when we can't think of anything else to get for someone, it's like, okay, I'm gonna get them an Echo Dot or <laughs> you know, I'm going to get them a wallet this year. Like you just have those items that you know are going to be safe items that you're going to be sharing with someone and in most likelihood they're going to love it. So let me know in the comments below what that is for you and I can't wait to hear your ideas. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, do all the things to keep me alive here on YouTube and I will see you all real soon. Take care. Bye.